To conclude the theatre district, we'll be having a look at a little therapy room. You've got your little chair, little thing to put your feet up, and of course, someone that's going to pay an you're going to pay an awful lot of money to to listen to your problems. Uh, I imagine this is what this building was used for. The wee lamp for ambience. You know, you know it's a therapy room. Now there is a wee wooden crate up here. That's not explosives, which is a bit of a pity. It's also counted as a location on its own, but I wanted to combine the two because yeah, I just didn't think one little wooden crate. Just sitting up here. I wanted to talk more about the therapy room. Uh, you can, of course, get a wee cooler of items. Uh, can you even sit on this? That's uh, that's a wee point for discussion. Uh, no, you can't even sit in the ottoman. Which is strange. It's very odd that they would add this, but not make it so that you could wait. And then sometimes in the rubble you get the odd item that you can sit on and you can wait. So, uh, yeah. Now, if we move on through the building... We can find at the rear here a little um, person enjoying themselves. Well, there was enjoying themselves. A few liqueur bottles. You were probably someone that needed the therapy room. And unfortunately, that didn't work. But that is, uh, yeah, a lot of the people in this pre-war era seem to have a lot of drinking problems. Have you noticed that? Like an awful lot of the skeletons and all. I suppose with the economic downturn and the energy price crisis and I'm starting to step a wee bit away from this game and into reality. Wow. We've come we've come a long way, haven't we? <laughs> but yeah. That's the therapy room pretty much covered. It would make sense it was in downtown. Probably serviced a lot of the high level executives, maybe a wee swanky place. Um, that you obviously would have paid an awful lot for its service. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. We'll see you all in the next one. Thank you.